she's here. <laughs> hey, you came. you weren't gonna come. Well, a bit of me worried that. Um. <clears throat> come on, get out of the rain. is still away in England. His wives are still here, but they shouldn't bother us. If they ask, you're a victim who I've hypnotized and lured to the castle. <laughs> Come on, I lit us a fire. <laughs> here. Nice and cosy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it was a night kind of like this when we first met. <laughs> when you came to find me. A lot's changed since then, though. <laughs> Back then I was by myself pretty much all the time. I mean, I had my father's wives, but... They don't make for especially good company. But now, I get to have you come visit me all the time. <laughs> that offer still stands if you'd like to move in here. I know it's not the most inviting place in the world, but we could make it more inviting. I'm no expert in interior design, but I think I could give it a shot. <laughs> oh, um, I was looking through this book the other day that was about just this. Ah, uh, what was it called? It was about how to arrange furniture in a room to make it more inviting, and how to design a room to feel more cosy. Sorry, I'm rambling at you again. It's just... <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen you. <laughs> I really miss you. <sighs> well... I know it's not been that long since you last came here, but... It feels like a long time. Are you really going to pretend like you didn't miss me as well? Not even a little bit. <laughs> of course you did. Okay. Are you sure? You seem a little. <laughs> hey, little kitty. <laughs> oh, um, I forgot to tell you. I kind of got a cat. <laughs> psst, psst. <laughs> she kind of just showed up last week. At first I thought she was one of my father's wives in disguise, but no, nope. turns out she was just a little floof. <laughs> of course. 
course you can pet her. She's very friendly. <laughs> oh, she's purring. <laughs> she seems to like you. Oh, um, I hadn't thought of a name yet. I kind of, um, wanted to wait to ask you. <laughs> what do you think we should name her? <laughs> I know, it's hard to think of a name when you're put on the spot. You don't have to think of a name just yet. I'll probably just keep calling her Little Kitty, even after we figure out a name. <laughs> She's so cute, isn't she? <sighs> okay, what's wrong? You're not yourself, I, I can tell. have something to tell me. Okay. What is it? What's the matter? You want to take me up on my offer? You want to move in? Uh, <laughs> that's great. Uh, Yes, um, of course. I'd love that. <laughs> uh, oh gosh. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm sorry, I, I'm really excited, that's amazing. Uh, what's wrong, though? You don't seem quite as excited as I do. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I love you. <laughs> I love you a lot. Um, you want me to turn you into a vampire? Okay, um, you don't have to be a vampire to move in with me. You can live with me as a human. I. You want to be a vampire? Are you are you sure? It's not easy. I um you can't go out in the day. You can't wear silver. <laughs> uh, uh, well, no, you you can eat garlic. I and that's perfectly fine, I think. I would be happy to turn you, but I want you to be 100% sure that this is what you want. Okay, um, yeah, I'll turn you into a vampire then. Oh, um, now, um, uh, right, uh, um, okay, uh, I didn't realise you wanted to do it now, um, it'll hurt a bit, um, 
first I have to drink some of your blood and then you drink some of... I, you know, um... Okay, um... Uh, um... Uh, um... Uh, yeah, I'm... Okay. I'm just... I'm a little nervous. I've never done this before. Um, are you comfortable? Okay, um, let me brush your hair out of the way. Sorry, this all hurt a bit. drink for my wrist. Ah, right, um, sorry. I'll break the skin for you. you drank more than enough. <laughs> oh, sorry. It probably tastes kind of funny for a human. You'll develop a taste for it. sure how long it takes. Like I said, I've never done this before, and I was born a vampire, so, um, I think it takes about a week. <laughs> mm. <laughs> it's exciting. Don't worry, I'll help you through the transformation process and help you adjust to being a vampire. I was wondering what you'd run off to. 